blood on the street is, you're ready to start building communism again. Yes, you're ready to start building communism again. You've built it before. They've built it before. Hasn't really worked out yet. But neither has love. Should we just stop building love too? So, what about all that communism you've promised to build? Word on the street is, you've woken up from a thousand years of slumber, promising to erect a version of communism, many times greater than any attempted before. Is that true? You keep saying things like, down with the bourgeoisie, eat the rich, sodomize the landowners, impel all people who have more than 25 real in their pockets, literally murder all human beings, regardless of their political beliefs, that kind of stuff. Oh yes, the mask of ambivalence, don't deny it, you're about to rip it off and reveal the monstrous seven-eyed lamb of global communism that would devour and masticate mankind. Everyone can see that. So tell me, do you have any questions before we fire up the big communism builder? Or do we get run right down to it? Failure. It's about failure. Yes, abject failure. Total irreversible defeat on all fronts. Absolutely vanquished, beaten, curb stomped and pissed on until you came along. You will reverse the fortune of the workers of the world. You alone, against every living thing, against every human alive. 800 trillion real in the hands of an impossibly well-organized ruling class. Towering city blocks of bankmen who have the ears of prime ministers. Million-headed armies of nations and the love of your own mother. You, against the atom, the charm, and the spin, where the whole world failed. Matter failed to bend to human will. Human will fail to get out of bed and tie its laces. You alone, single-handedly, will rebuild the dreams of the working class. You are the last 